Facebook and DJ Crow Artist Group, I wanted to take a moment in time to address a serious matter with our group page. Um, the other day I had received a message from a member that I didn't realize had dropped out um, and it was in my other folder and I just wanted to address this just in case anyone else feels this way in the group. Um, the message basically um, was saying uh, the person came off and said hey you know I don't like the way you run this page um, this is what you're doing you're doing two things you're trying to run a business and then you're trying to run a club page with that said business underneath there this is Luna she's my cat hi Luna hi guys um, but she had well sorry I was got distracted uh, anyway first said hey you know you're trying to do two things and by doing these two things you're not able to focus and this that and the other and the group page is also part of your business name this that and the other and when it came down to it they were like they were like um, you're, you're taking control of all the projects you're not letting anyone do this or that or the other um, you you don't let people speak for themselves you basically have full control of the group it's either your way or the highway that's not the case at all the case in being you know it isn't my way or the highway I'm not really the leader of the group I'm more of like a supervisor yeah and the, the funny thing about him mentioning the name of the group the, the thing was he joined the club with that name being said. If you didn't like the name of the group, then don't join. Fair enough. I ain't, I'm not changing the name. Why is it called that? Well, it is my it is my club. I started it, I created it, and I supervise it. So therefore, it is going to be part of my business. And the reason it's named kind of after my business is my business is all about the experience. And this club is about giving people the experiencing, but also encouraging people to take more into their passion. People don't see what this group is about. And that's why I'm making this video. That's why I want to talk to you guys about what this is about. Um, there are so many things that are going on. Another thing that was said in that message was like, you know, if you don't let people speak up in the group and pick up their own projects and you need to start paying us, that really made me laugh because this group is not, I've always said that this group is all about having fun. You know, there's no membership fee here. There's no anything. You're here on your own recognizance. That's pretty much it. It's all about having fun. It's all about doing projects together that we like as a whole. Now, have I been suggesting projects more than other people? Yeah, but it's also because people haven't been posting that much either. People haven't been suggesting projects. So when no one suggests a project, I suggest a project. And that's how it goes, you know. And, and I'm not saying, hey, everyone in the group, you're doing this with me. No, I'm saying, hey, who would like to join me on this project? That's pretty much how it is. Um, but that was just, you know, and uh, he's, like, um, he's like, yeah, this group just doesn't have a direction and all that. And to my argument with that is I just recently put in an admin besides myself and Maria and his name is Hunter Douglas, you guys have seen him post stuff and so I have a lot of faith in him as an admin, he's younger than I am by like a, almost 10 years and I figured that he would be a better admin, you know, not, not saying I'm not an admin anymore, but I figured he'd be a better choice of having as a third admin, get a younger person's views, also get younger members in the group, people that are in high school that don't really have creation and photography and art as an outlet and try to bring them in and keep them in a safer environment. I'm not, I'm not the boss of the group, I'm just a supervisor. I basically just, I will look at projects if they come along and I'll say, hey, I think this is a good idea and this is the legal route we should go, this is the how we should do it. And then when members get added, um, I'll, I look at them and try to make sure they're clean members for the group, that they're not druggies or or criminals or anything like that and I just kind of I kind of monitor the group I try to keep it safe and um, the only thing I want to say that about the group is I just want to see people participate more I want to see people post more I want to see people get more interactive that's pretty much all it is 
and a lot of people would say, oh, I'm busy, I'm busy, I'm busy, I'm busy. Bull crap, you're not busy. You're lazy. That's pretty much the bottom line to it. You, you, you need to get into your passion. If, if art is your passion, or anything in this group is your passion, get into it. Do not sit there and say you don't have time. People have the mo People are amazing. The human mind is incredible. You can do anything if you put your mind to it. So give yourself 5 to 15 minutes a day or a night, right before you go to bed, check out the group, read what we're doing, comment, like, post, share, whatever. But just participate. Um, one thing we do have coming up that I'm really excited about that Hunter started is we have the photo walk that the, it is this Friday, November 7th at uh, 4.30. Um, we're going to be doing photos. Marie and I might dress up in our Halloween costumes since we didn't get that many shots. And then we're going to be going out to dinner afterwards and socializing. I cordially invite everyone that you can. I really hope to see a lot of people there. Regardless how many show up, whether it's just me, Maria, and Hunter, and a few others, whatever shows up, we're going to have fun. You guys are missing out if you don't show up. That's your own fault. And with that note, guys, remember every frame counts, and so do you, and I will catch you later.